All right, everyone, you know what today is. Today is Wednesday, and that means you know it. Wednesday is usually Fusion Strike Day, so we got ourselves a case of building battle boxes. I did I did this with Evolving Skies. I pulled the uh, pulled the Rapaz of VMAX out of Evolving Skies. So, so I'm still looking for the Mew VMAX, so that's what I'm hoping for this week. This week. So, uh, yeah, let's get this party started. I mean, these I mean these things, you know, there's 10 of them in here, four packs a piece, you know. Got the promos that I get to show off a little bit. Let me get my garbage a little closer to me. There we go. All right. Beautiful, beautiful boxes. I love I love building battle kits. I don't know why. I just really do. I like these things. These things are kind of fun. You know, they're nice. They're a little small, a little pretty. And I use these. When people order big big amounts of cards, I usually put the cards in one of these to protect them. So, yeah. Anyway, without further ado, yeah, let's get started here. Let's crack open this first one. We get to see the... There's our four, four different... Four different promos for Fusion Strike. And uh, these boxes are definitely hit and miss. I will tell you that right away. They are definitely a hit and miss kind of thing. I will show off the promos for every single one of them. And the promo for this one is Latias. Probably the most expensive promo. It's definitely used. I like Latias. It's, it's nice. It's like a, like a $4, $5 promo, I'm pretty sure. I'm not 100% sure on that. I haven't looked at the promo prices in it. But we get four packs of each one, too. And we got one of each artwork. Awesome. Well, as we crack open this pack, I'll say, hey, you guys, you know, please, you know, consider hitting that subscribe button, hitting the like, you know, leaving me a good comment, you know, whatever you want to leave me, I don't care, you know. Um, I just appreciate the support and love that I always get from you guys, so uh, thank you for that. We are looking for Mew Maxes. We look for Genesec Vs. We are looking for stuff in general. I don't know. Stuff I don't have. And, oh, look at that. We got a Sydney. Right off the bat. Look at that. We got a Sydney, which is definitely... A new card for me that's my last full art trainer i now have all the trainers all the full art trainers that's awesome that is an interesting start one thing i'll note i'm kind of shocked about how kind of good and bad these boxes can be because you think as in building bow kits they want to promote the set really hard so once in a while you get boxes that are really good and some of them are really really bad but we all know what i'm looking for i'm looking for those muse where are my muse Mew has been hiding me. It's been very elusive the last couple of openings, if you guys haven't noticed. So, hey, Electrode. I'm pretty sure it's a reverse I don't have yet. And Glaring Corsola. All right. Let's keep on moving along here. Um, also, I will say, if you guys don't know, if you guys I have a TCG player, help support the channel by buying cards off of me. That'd be awesome. And if you uh, do buy something off of me and it's on my YouTube channel... Just say, just if you heard it off my YouTube channel and you're buying stuff off of me, just say, um, send me a message in the in the buyer's messages, you know, saying he saw it on my YouTube, and I need that double too. Sweet. And pickable. Um, actually, I got these reverse halls and rares swapped around over here. There we go. That's better. And I'll give you 10 free code cards. They'll be random. They won't be just Fusion Strike, I promise, even though some people like Fusion Strike. Some people like the newer, newer, uh, code cards. I have a ton of code cards. Got like three ETBs full of code cards. I don't even know what I'm even doing with them all. I'm like, I'm sitting here like, mm, I like playing the TCG player. Should I just redeem some of them? So we got, oh, we got the Rillaboom VMAX. Wow, that box was good. And this is the last, the last ultra rare that I'm missing. Man, that box is good for us. We got like four new cards out of that box. This is the last ultra rare I'm missing. Out of the original original set, not the not you know obviously not the. Uh... Let's keep on rolling along here. God, what was I gonna say? What was I trying to say? Well, oh, these boxes can be really difficult to open up too. I should have left my scissors next to me. Um, I got something there. We go. There we go. We got we we got stuff here. I got a box cutter next to me. There we go. Thank you for my job providing you box cutters. We got ourselves Deoxys for the promo this time. I think Lottie Us. We got Lottie Us, Lottie Os. We got some pack carts, all one of each. I highly doubt they'll all be like that, but you never know. Maybe they are. Maybe it's one of those things where they're trying to promote the, the set. I got this build a battle box like right away, so maybe there there will be some good stuff in here. Maybe this was one of those things where they were trying to promote the set really hard. So maybe there'll be a lot of good stuff in this box. I mean, I really like building battles. And oh, okay, we got a, we got a hollow rare. Okay. It's, st it's still a hit. Technically, it was still a hit. I'll... Yeah. Um, I noticed that these building battle boxes are actually decently cheap. Like, you can get a, a whole case of them for, uh, I think it's 135 on TCG Player. Something like that. Which, 
that's not bad. I mean, it's 40 packs for $135. Uh, I guess it's not super, super great because the booster box is 36 And golem. You know, 36 packs for about $100 for a box. So, yeah, you're probably paying a little bit more for those extra four packs. But you get the promos. Promos probably cancel it out a little bit. And these things are really fun. Like, if you have a lot of friends, like, hey, let's make a little pre-release tournament of our own, you know, kind of thing. It'd be fun. Like, you're like, hey, but they're all my cards. Just so you guys know. Don't touch my cards. They're all my cards. <laughs> I mean, that's how I'd be. I guess, like, hey, those are my cards. I bought the case. You guys didn't. Okay, we got Lucario. Okay. Nothing too exciting. Still an ultra rare. You know, I will say when I did my opening, when I did my pre-release tournament, I didn't get, like, any ultra rares in my, in my building battle kit. There you go. Lucario, Kamehameha Waven. Or is it Aura Sphere? Is that what it is? Hey, it is. That's what the move is on the card. I don't know how I knew that. I think it's more like I knew that from uh, Pokemon Go, probably. Lucario was past the time of me when I actually played. We still have not gotten into any adventures discoveries yet, so there's that too. We got Dracopult and Electrode. Okay, okay. Not too bad though. Not too bad. There was there were two. There was a like 50 50 on that box too. Next box. Boom. Boom. Beautiful box. Yeah. And we're okay. I know. I feel like there's a lot like a lot of background going on in this one. I wish one of those things where I'm like, here's another Deoxys. One of those things where I wish, uh, there we go, now we got Pekka that are not together. Which is a little different. Because, uh, I wish I had a face camera. You guys could see all the uh, background noise, too, I guess. Be throwing stuff around, just trying to hurry up as quickly as possible so this video doesn't take super, super long. 40 packs, so you assume it's going to be about 30 minute long video. Unless we just get something absolutely insane, which would be awesome. I will try to go through these packs quickly as possible. You know, I don't want you to keep you guys here too long. What do we got here? We got some energy. It's Nine Tails. Love that Nine Tails. Token tomorrow. Quick Ball. Shinx. Hey, Shinx. What's up, Zora? And Shelter. Grover. And Claydol. All right. Nothing there. Let's keep on going. Right, we're going to have our first dud box where we got absolutely nothing. This is pack number three of this box. Of the pack number three of the, of the third box. All right. What pack over is it? Number eight total. Anyways, Skater, Frostmoth, Nighttails, Totodile, what's up Totodile, Clubopus, Zora again, Skitty, and that's all. I feel like a lot of those, uh, you know, for how big this set is, I feel like you get a lot of the same commons and uncommons. Because like, you're trying to get certain commons, like, for me, like, oh, I want Adventurous Discoveries, you know, they're like $2 cards. I can sell them on my TCG player, which, hey, um, hey, Fusion Strike. But because it's, it feels like this set's so freaking huge... It's hard to get those cards, and they're very short print. It feels like and Dragapult. No, nothing, nothing exciting in that box was there. No ultra rare. Where we're, we're gonna have to move on to the next one. Just like this. Fusion Strike. I'm getting close. I would say I'm getting close to finishing this stuff off. I mean, I feel like we're getting we're we're getting there. And it's another Deoxys. Lame. We want three Deoxys already. One of each pack artwork. Maybe it's good luck. Here we go. I mean, every time we got one of each pack artwork, we got an ultra rare. So there's that. I mean, even though it's only three boxes so far, <laughs> we're on a fourth box, guys. We got crossover. Supposedly that card was used in a Mew deck, and it's not bad actually. I'm like, eh. hey, we got ourselves a Bolton. We got ourselves a Bolton. All right, all right. It's an ultra rare. Look at that. Somehow I just can't made that come out of thin air right there. Ultra rare, but can we get a can we get a full Mew? Can we get a V Max? I know when I was in my uh, my pre-release tournament, someone pulled the uh, full art Mew V, so the ultimate art one. So yeah, that'd be cool. And somehow my girlfriend's kid is getting real, is getting closer to finishing this up than me, which I don't know how that's even possible. I mean, half of it, that's because I'm trading him cards that I have duplicates of, and he has cards that I don't have, like. Two of the Mew V Maxes. And he has a Celebi. And yeah, I don't have those. I mean, I have like the trainers and stuff like that, which he doesn't have. Man, this pack that won't open up, it just exploded. Okay, here we go. And we're swinging around. Let's get something good here. We have Whaley Tough. Whaley Tough's always good. You knitting him. And oh, another real V Max. 
Here they come. Here they come, guys. Real Boom VMAX. He, he, he was hiding, and now all of a sudden he's just, he's just out there. He's just going to be showing everywhere now. Real Boom VMAX. How, what do you know? Don't have one yet. All of a sudden you get two. Take that. So, yeah. This, this box has been pretty good. I told you. The boxes that have one of each pack artwork have been the good ones so far. Let's see what, what see we get in here. Uh huh. This stack's starting to fall over on me. Still no Adventures Discovery. Still sad about that. We have Voltorb though. Look at that Voltorb. Helioptile. And Toxtricity. Hollow Rare. Man, not bad though. Those three packs technically had a, a hit in them. If I consider Hollow Rare's a hit. I mean, it's not a regular rare, so it's a hit, right? So, eh. Still trying to go pretty fast through here for it. Hey, we got a new one. Oricorio. Did not know Oricorio was in here. Nice, nice. Love the Oricorio. And here we got, oh, oh, we got two Mews. It's going to be a bad box. Feel it. That's our first Oricorio box, so let's we'll see what happens there. This pack does not want to open up for the life of it. There you go. I do love these Bill and Bowser. I don't know why. I think this is fun. Bill and Bowser are fun. I was... I mean, I wish I had friends where I can do the I can actually make little tournaments like this, you know? Absol and Golem. Okay. What up, Golem? Keep moving along here, guys. What do you guys think about Bone Battle Kits? You guys are are you guys interested in them at all? You know, it's it's, it's like I bought in the case of the uh, evolving skies, now I got the case of this one. I like I like doing opening. I'm not gonna lie. It's something fun to do. It's something different. I mean, not everybody does openings of Bone Battle Kits. I know like Leanheart does, but hey, we got a Bolton! I don't know why it took me so many to... We got a full art Bolton V. Look at that beautiful Bolton. Ah, so happy, though. What a happy puppy. He's a happy pupper. He's a happy puppy. Look how cute he is. Hey, Bolton. I mean, I don't know if you guys have noticed or not, but this this uh, Bill and Battle Kit's kind of like... Kind of been a little on fire. I mean, <laughs> we are halfway through it. But what does halfway mean? That's 20 packs, and we have gotten 6 Ultra Rare so far. And I'm pretty sure I just saw some gold behind this. I could be lying. Let's see what we got here. We got ourselves double and... Oh, we got the Flaffy! We finally got the Flaffy! Oh, buddy, yes! I finally got my Flaffy! Oh, man, it took me so long. So many packs. So long. Let's up Flaffy. Oh, man, I'm so happy. I finally got my Flaffy. I had a feeling my Bill and Bow box is gonna be where it was at. Oh, and then, and who? If you would have gotten this Bill and Battle box <coughs> on a pre-release, this Bill and Battle box has been on fire. This is the last pack of it. We've gotten the Gold Flaffy and we got in the Bolton. There's always like one or two that are extremely just really good in a box. And I know this one's also supposed to be a good code. And it's a Toxtricity. Okay. Whew. Whew. We got the Flaffy, everybody. Finally, finally got the Flappy. We got another Bill and Bow box. Come down, guys. We're only halfway done. We're already halfway done. We're we're doing that good already, guys. And it's and gals, and we're halfway done. And we got Ladius, Ladius again. And we got do have one of each pack artwork, so supposedly that's a good look. Can we get the Mew V Max or the Gengar or the Espeon? That's what be that would make this. Opening is absolutely insane. I honestly, if you just pull one of those cards, you you almost get the, your money's worth out of this whole box. So uh, just the thought of that is kind of like insane in itself, because this Bill and Bow box is decently cheap. You know, for hey, Cramomatic, that's going to get put in my deck. And Zero Aura. Yeah, still need the uh, Mew V Maxes because I've only pulled one so far, Ollie. That's a really hard card to pull. I don't know why. It's an expensive card too, so it's like I want to just pull it. I don't want to really go buy them. Like thirty dollars a piece. It's like, jeez. I mean, I did. Just, I mean, and I need this Genesex too. I still need two Genesex. Genesex doesn't want to come out either. And, and, zoom around. Need the reverse Merrill. I know that. Come on now. All of a sudden, the, the flavor has gotten pulled out of this out of this opening. We hit the we hit the flappy, and all of a sudden it's over. There you go. I, I, I told you guys, I, I told you, I, I do feel like these Bill and Bow kits are where, where some of it's at because they are trying to promote the set in these pre-releases. So you would think that they would have more pulls in these things. And the Regnoid. And this box, I'd be sad if I was this person buying this box right now. But 
one pack could just change that whole thing. This pack just fell apart too as soon as I touched it. Ugh. Oh, yep, 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 yep. Got it. Jeez. There you go. And we are off. We got some metal energy. Sydney, we already got your full art, buddy. We don't need you coming around anymore. I love that bundle B. It's probably my favorite artworks of the set. Drober again and Quistry. That box was absolutely atrocious. I would feel sorry for the person who had that box in their tournament. This one looks like it's been like really banged up. Look at it. It's just really badly wrapped and stuff like that. It's odd. It is what it is. I mean, come on now. How does Pokemon say that's good quality? Jeez. And we're throwing stuff in the back. Whoop. And another or Corio, guys. No, uh, I, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I keep on saying guys. I'm like, I know I shouldn't. I'm trying to be like I want to each pack artwork. I'm trying to be uh, what's that word? Uh, open-minded ish, whatever you want to call it, for that kind of thing. I am open-minded towards that. Like I have no problem with that part. Anyway, we're not gonna, we're not gonna get to that. We're not we're not gonna start talking about that. Where are all those adventurers discoverers at? I still haven't found one yet. Where are you at? Hey, and Didi though, and Claydol. I don't need you, in Didi. Or do I? I don't know. I, there are some like ultra rares, like if I see them, I know I need them. Like, oh yeah, 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 I need that one. Come on, building battle boxes. It's supposed to be amazing for me. Where you at? Come on, where you at? Send me, see, send me again, battle pass. We have ourselves Rotom, Smeargle, Carvana, Unana. Grab an extra card, my bad guys. I like that snow though. The snow looks really nice with the reverse. And piled, a pile of sand. Just a pile of sand. Got them sandy vibes. It's really cold right now, you know, living in Iowa. It's cold. We don't like to live in Iowa. I hate living in Iowa. I'm not going to lie. It, I can't say it's boring. You know, every state has their own boring things, you know. But, man, I can't stand the cold. I don't know why I stopped at that church in there. I thought that was a rare. And I looked at it, I'm like, oh, it's just one common card. I don't know. This was how much I paid attention. Rotom and or Corio. All right. That's not a bad card. <laughs> Yes, I still have a cough. Can't believe I'm still sick. It's been like two weeks. But I don't understand. I don't get it. It just won't go away. And, and sometimes I feel really good, and sometimes it's just all of a sudden I have a coughing attack. I don't understand. I think it is bronchitis. I'm pretty sure it is. It's just in my lungs. I can feel it like developing and fixable. But because I do feel better, like I don't feel sick. My, you know, my, you know, everything feels fine. It's just that for some reason. All of a sudden, I just get a random coughing attack. And when I breathe, I can feel like the, the, the mucus kind of like rattling in my esophagus, which is another Oricorio. Nice. I love Oricorio. And we got one of each pack of again. We have just ran into two Bill Mouth kits in a row that were absolutely plain. Come on. Come on now. Don't be playing with me like this. I was just talking up, talking you up after hitting that Flaffy. We haven't hit one card since we got that Flaffy. Not a hollow rare, not nothing. Come on. Come on, Flaffy, you ain't just gonna drain out all the love right there at the very end, are you? We were having such a good streak on cards. Verizon. We were having such a good streak on hitting. What we have, we're at? We have seven Ultra Rares and four Hollow Rares. So the Ultra Rares are beating the Hollow Rares, which is... I'm excited about to hear that. That's always exciting to me. Let's see what we get here. Come on now. We can do it. We can do it. I, I, there was, I mean, I don't know. Boltoy and Hollow Rare Deoxys. At least it's a Hollow Rare. I got, finally got a Hollow Rare. Jeez. I really want that. I really want the Genesex. Where's the Genesex at? Come on. Come on. And I'm, I'm sure you guys are getting really bored of Fusion Strike. God. I love Fusion Strike still, but even, even me, I'm getting bored of it. I mean, that's like, sometimes, honestly, it's the pull rates. It's like, God. Come, what's Double Caterpie? Okay. What's up, Caterpie? Didn't know I needed two of you, but apparently you thought I did. This, is this going to be our third box in a row without an Ultra Rare? Like I said, sometimes these things are really, really rough. Sometimes they're really good. You just, like we had that, that one that had that had the Flaffy and it had the full art Bolton in it, too. It's like, jeez. Get two really good cards in one box. But apparently, you know, we're getting close, though. So, you know, honestly, and cool. we only have two more boxes left, and we're only at the 20-minute mark, so we are doing blazing through this stuff all right you know even with the uh horrible intro and stuff like that <laughs> anyways 
Let's see what we can get in this one. Can we get... Oh, there's the last one. There's a Pinkerton. I couldn't remember what it was. Uh, I don't even know what this Pinkerton even does or why it's even like... Why it's a promo. But, nonetheless, that was the last promo. We did, I did got to display all the promos. And we got one of each back over again. We only got this one. One more left. Got it. And, and we are done. It was a fun opening already. I would love to get like another Flaffy. That'd be awesome. Ain't gonna happen. <laughs> but... Hey, you can't, gotta love the Flaffies, though. Gotta give Flaffy some love. I was just... Ah, man. I can't believe it took me that long to pull that card. And... Uh, Landorus. Uh, all of a sudden, the Hollow Rares are catching up. They said... Uh, it, I told them that they were the Ultra Rares were ahead by a long shot. And just like that, the Hollow Rares were like... Yeah, uh, hold my beer. You know. I guess I should say It's kind of a kid's show. Or is it kids? I don't know. I haven't looked at the analytics on that part. If it's more kids that watch this, I highly doubt it. Or if it's adults, because I put that's not really necessarily, not necessarily kid. It's kid friendly. Like I don't swear any of that. But oh, we got the Mew. We got the Mew. Oh my, we got my Mew. We finally got the Mew. Wow. We got my Mew alternate art Mew V. Oh man, I'm so happy. I have not bought this card yet. I've seen this card so many times in in card shops. I'm so. Happy I got this card. If I could just get the Mew V Max. If I could just get the Mew V Max. I got the Flaffy. I mean, there's not much more. I mean, I, I still want the Celebi. <coughs> wow. That's what I had to do to pull something. I had to open up some building battle kits. Jeez. Oh, man. This opening was... Just, this box was absolutely on fire. This, I'll be honest with you. The Evolving Skies box. The Punny Ain't. They know the pony was even in this deck, in this set. I'll be honest with you, my Evolving Skies, like, Golden Battle Kit was extremely sad. Like, if it wasn't for that Rapaza VMAX, there wouldn't have been a lot in there. And this one is just absolutely just amazing. Like, I can't believe how good this box is. And I still got one more left. We got one more left. Bunny, Voltorb, Pansage, Q-Font, Flagar, Slugma, Chansey, and a Dragapult. Not bad. Not bad, not bad. Last one, last box. Can I get the Mew VMAX into here? Can we get the Mew VMAX? I mean, basically, the only thing we're missing right now is, is a rainbow. Or, uh, for real, ult. I mean, we got an alternate art. We got two ult. Wait, 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 I got a full art, but we got an alternate art, too, now. So, it's like, eh, okay. What's left? What will our last promo be? It's going to be a Oricore. You know you call it. I, I don't know how many Oricores we get in here, but I love Oricore. It's really good. Really good one, I can't complain. Two Gengars, uh-oh. Uh-oh. That's bad news, Bears. See what we get here, guys. Anyway, thank you guys so much for your love and support and watching this video. I, I hope this actually gets really good, some really good views, because this this thing, this box is absolutely just a banger. You, I don't, you don't see building battle kits do this well. I don't think you do. But yet, like I said, they you would think they would be good because they're trying to promote the set. So they give away good hits. A lot of times. But anyways, please think about hitting the subscribe button. Hit a like. Leave a comment. Tell me how, how good you think this one is. What do you guys think about building battle kits? You know, I think they're amazing. I've, I've never had a really an issue with them. I love opening them on the, on the side too. You know, they're nice and fun. Little fun openings. Thank you guys so much for your love and support. Think, look at... Ugh, Inteleon. It's an ultra rare. It's an ultra rare Inteleon. We can't, we can't complain. We are still hitting hits. Got two packs left. Also, try to help to support the channel by going to my TCG player and buying stuff off of there. Uh, I feel like I've kind of... It, it's been doing well. My TCG player has been doing really well. It's almost at that point where I've been getting so many good, so many orders. It's been keeping me busy. Keeping me really busy. And I'm really, excited, I'm really thankful for that. Because now that people are buying stuff off my TCG player, I can buy more cards to open up. Especially with the new set coming up. That really helps having that extra that extra support to buy more of the new set. Um, stay tuned for the rest of this week. You know, it, it's still gonna be nearly. We got. I don't. I knew know what I'm doing this week. That's for sure. But this is Monday. Monday is hitting off. You know, I mean not Monday. This is Wednesday, and we are hitting off with Fusion Strike like we have been because, well, Fusion Strike. I'm still got a lot of stuff left. We're getting there. We're walking. Hilly up tile. And for the last card of the day is a Mellow Edda. 
Mellow. Uh, well, get. Well. Well. Ahem. <coughs> Ahem. <coughs> that was an insane box of Bill and Battle kits. I cannot complete. That. If I was going to say, if I could hit any cards, getting the Mew and the Flaffy. I don't care about anything else. Just the Mew and the Flaffy, just right there, just made it happen. That made me so happy. Two of my most wanted cards of the set. The Flaffy I absolutely wanted. The Mew I absolutely wanted. Just, oh, it just makes me so much closer to being done with the set. I'm so happy to be almost done with this. I might actually finish this set before uh, Brilliant Stars even comes out. Wow, and we got, where else? We got nine hits. Feels like we did so much better. It does. But anyways, thank you guys for watching. It was awesome. I don't want to drag this out too much longer. I appreciate all the love and support. Come watch the rest of my videos. Come watch other previous videos. Any kind of watch time is really nice for me. Hit the subscribe button if you haven't subscribed before. Hit the notification bell. Come see me. Free code cards every single time I, I send out, I have videos out. Thank you for watching, guys. And until next time.